Now consumer demand and the change in income. So what happens when your M is going to change? We know that the budget line of a consumer is given as price time the quantity of the commodity being consumed plus the price of other commodity times the quantity of the other commodity being consumed if x1 and x2 are the commodities here. So based on that let us assume that a good x1 say for example a good x1 uh, it can be normal or inferior. So what is normal or inferior? It can be normal or inferior depending on the following two conditions. For normal good if the demand of commodity x so for simplicity what I am going to do is I am naming these two commodities as uh, x and y okay so if the demand of x rises say for example the demand of x goes up with increase in income so first your income increased which implied increase in demand of x it implies that this is a normal commodity so this is how we define a normal good okay and for an inferior good it's vice versa so it's opposite that if consumers demand for x is going to fall when the income is going to rise so increase in income if it leads to fall in demand for commodity x it means that it is inferior so this table is basically summarizing these two things so normal good if you are witnessing an increase in income and this results in increase in demand so it's a normal good and vice versa and for the inferior good if increase in income is there you are going to witness a decrease in demand from the consumer and vice versa and now how to go about represent this mathematically or graphically because in our previous expression when we are trying to highlight a demand function we have written that it can uh, of, uh, for demand for x say for example can be written as a function of uh, price of x price of y and income right so likewise how to go about represent uh, these goods now mathematically how to uh, denote it is that for normal goods say if the demand function for x is a function of price of x y and income so for normal good the key condition is that the change in the demand for x with respect to change in income is going to be positive right because as your income is going to change which means if your income is going to increase your demand for x if it's also increasing which means this expression is going to be positive it implies that this is normal good this is a normal good so this these are the signs I mean what it's denoting here in the expression and likewise in case of inferior good if we see that your demand for a commodity say for example commodity X if it's going to reduce if your income is going to increase so if your income increases it leads to fall in the demand of commodity X so this is going to be negative right so that's why this expression uh, is with the inequality less than zero so here M increases the entire function will take smaller values now let us understand this graphically now this is the case for a normal good consider uh, x1 x2 space where x1 and x2 are the two commodities and you had an initial budget line a b okay and this was your optimal point p now what happened that income of a consumer increased all right so what happened as a consequence of that is your optimal point consumption of the consumption bundle it also changed from p to q now you shifted from p to q so obviously at this point your consumption of q uh, i mean the bundle q implies that your consumption of both x1 and x2 commodities it has gone up if you compare here so what happens is that your consumption of x1 has increased from x0 to x0 prime and for the x2 bundle it has gone from x2 not to x2 prime so just a small correction here yeah so it, it will be x1 not to 
x1 prime and this is x2 not to x2 prime so if you observe here on both ends there is an increase right so increase in the consumption of x2 as well as increase in the consumption of x1 so what we can infer from here is that these both are normal goods these both are normal goods because increase in m implies increase in demand for demand for both x1 and x2 right so that's why now the next case is for the inferior goods now let us say that in the same xy plane if your price of one commodity okay uh, or 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 to make it simple uh, let us assume that x1 is inferior all right what does that mean it means that if the price is going to change or if your income is going to change let's we are talking about income forget prices so if your income is going to change say for example if delta m is there or m increases okay and uh, if x1 is inferior it implies if x1 is inferior and price uh, i mean the income increased what a consumer does is that he will prefer to consume more of the other commodity which is not inferior right for example consider a budget line ab here and you were at the optimal point p this is the consumption bundle the optimal consumption bundle at ab budget line now the income of a consumer went up where x1 is an inferior commodity we are assuming that so now what happens as a consumer you know that your income has gone up to a prime b prime budget line now you definitely will be favoring or you will be consuming a bundle which is having less of this inferior commodity because inferior commodity obviously demand for that will go down as your income increases as a consequence what happens you choose a point like q here now notice here that at point q your consumption of x2 your consumption of x2 is for example x2 prime and for x1 it's x1 prime and compare it with the initial case now initially if you observe you were consuming x1 not and x2 not so here what i want to emphasize is that your x2 consumption it has gone up right but your consumption of the inferior commodity has gone down so in case of inferior goods because x1 was inferior that's why consumer preferred less of x1 and chose x2 when the income went up from ab to a prime b prime budget line so the consumption of x2 went up so this is about the impact of change in income on the demand for goods i mean these two goods wherein the first good which was inferior is not being preferred in the optimal bundle whereas the good two is increasing in terms of the quantity consumed 